welcome guys guys today i'm going to show you how to use the self reference in excel to create an auto automatic sheet or how to use it cell reference so the automatic lead will fill in so as you have already seen here the received amount paid pending balance sales i have made some data small very small two two numbers only so how you going to use the cell reference and how you going to use the formulas the simple of course some formula here to create an autofill sheet so in this sheet what you have seen here everything is already there in the place so first i'm going to change or delete some of those so you will understand so those numbers i need to I will delete all those numbers. So as you see, there was a formula. So automatically everything became zero when I deleted those numbers. So this is how you can create a small format for your work, or to calculate even your income and spend whatever the money you spend daily. So this is pretty much easy here. here i'm talking about the sales so this amount paid i have right here the pending balance let's say i'm calculating 1000 so sales so 900 is paid 100 is pending balance same 700 is paid 300 balance so total 1000 sales so here those numbers are ready now i need to put the formula some formula okay so the amount paid so total amount paid is select both the cells and press enter so 1600 next pending balance how much is the pending balance so you need to use some formula or just plus same goes to sales so it be 2000 equals 1000 plus 1000 so it will be 2000 all right so far it's very easy no rocket science nothing now here we go total pending so here instead of typing the same formula we can just put the cell reference so total pending falls in us reference e7 yes under e7 if you type e7 here equals e7 press enter so the value of the cell you will see the 400 is already there now total paid is in c7 and total sales is in g7 equals g7 so do not forget you need to use equals before typing the cell reference and that is how it works pretty simple you change something there it will change automatically in both places so this is how you can make this kind of sheet with the cell reference as you see the numbers are changing wherever i am changing the data the numbers are changing and now i will show you how to put date and time so this is date and time yes when i the formula of date and time equals now bracket open bracket close okay again i'm going to put here equals now bracket open bracket close press enter you see it's 15 12 20 20 11 25 25 so that's it for this video guys please subscribe